In this video, I'm gonna be showing you everything that I got at Hyper Japan. Now, it's not a lot, but it is cute. Hey guys, it's your girl Aisha Shasha, and as you will already know, I went to Hyper Japan on the 13th of July and I had a blast. If you didn't know about that, then you can go ahead and check out my vlog if that's something that interests you. I will be linking that at the end of this video. Now, those of you who watched my vlog will know that A, I arrived there late, B, I arrived there hungry, and C, therefore, didn't have a lot of time to film everything and to visit everywhere. There were so many different stalls there that I just didn't get a chance to see. Literally, the place was absolutely packed and it, it was just heaving with people and hot air. <laughs> So like, I just couldn't get everywhere. Like I just, I just, I just couldn't, all right? So next time, next time I will get there on time. <laughs> and I still stand by the fact that it wasn't my fault. Anyway, let's dive into this bag and see what we have. So the first thing I'm gonna pull out, this was a, um, uh, a lucky bag. Well, I say lucky bag. You can see what's in the bag, but like it's kind of like a little lucky bag. And this is from uh, Miss Lou to you. Hey girl, if you're watching. Um, and she was basically doing these little bags whereby you get two t-shirts and a, oh, is it a necklace? Oh my gosh, I thought it was just like a little charm. Oh, okay, so I didn't realize that you get a little necklace inside. Oh my gosh. So, I've not looked at these yet, all right? So we're gonna, dive straight in but oh my goodness can you guys see oh, no of course you can't see look at the exposure <laughs> let me sort that out how adorable is that that is like right up my street absolutely gorgeous i will definitely be rocking that that's so so cute now t-shirt number one this one let's see what's on the front i all i was i was just i was just excited because it was pink and the other one was blue and the other t-shirt that I got was um purple so like I'm just excited for that <laughs> and this one <laughs> this one <laughs> this one says this is so me because I am the shyest person ever it says please don't take my photo without permission because you know me I hate having my photo taken. Can't stand it. Can't stand it. <laughs> oh my goodness. I love it. I love it. I love it. This is this is very, very me. It's so me because it's not me. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna be rocking that. Oh my god, I'm dropping everything on the floor. I'm so excited. Oh, I love it. And it's very good quality as well, actually. Really liking the quality. The thing with um, Miss Lou to you, she is a plus size girl and she most certainly does cater for us other plus size beauties as well. Um, and of course, every other size leading up to that, but it's just nice to see plus size kawaii fashion being represented, you know? So she is most definitely your girl for that. She makes so many different things from dresses to leggings, tops, jewelry, everything basically. So. I'll be putting her link in the description box below so you guys can go ahead and go and check her out. Let's see what the second t-shirt is. I have no idea what this is. <laughs> what is it? Oh my gosh. This is gorgeous. These are all her own designs as well. Oh my gosh. Basically, I just said to myself that I want my money to go on people who like design their own stuff. And cause like normally I would go straight to Artbox and just buy everything from Artbox. But like I can get that on their website or I can go to London and get that, you know. I just wanted to actually show some love to the um, like, you know, handmade sellers that are there. And this is a gorgeous, gorgeous design. I absolutely love that. It's a merbear. How beautiful is she? I'm so happy to have like just some more nice t-shirts in my um, kawaii wardrobe. Oh, I'm loving that. I'm gonna have to do like a whole lookbook for all of these things. I'm not gonna try everything on now because it's late and I'm hot and I'm tired, okay? I'll, you know you know me already, you know I wanna do this thing properly, so. 
I will definitely be um, uh, showing you how I am going to be styling these outfits. I love, love, love that. That's adorable. Okay, next we're gonna go to Miss Lou to use Mum, Little Bat Blue. Now, last year I bought the most adorable octopus from her um, and we called her Nemu. Well, actually Riley called her Nemu. Um, <laughs> And yeah, you may have sometimes see me wear her in my hair. Um, I'll flash up a picture now. <laughs> and I just absolutely fell in love with her. And this time round, she had the big mama. Are you ready? Are you ready? I don't know if you're ready, guys. Oh my God. In three, two, one. <laughs> oh my days. <laughs> Look at the size of that. This has been hand crocheted, feels so, so soft, so adorable. She has a detachable hair clip. And it's funny because she was like, yeah, um, the actual hair clip, it is actually a hair clip, you know, so it does come off, so you can use it in your hair. I'm like, use this hair clip in my hair? Girl, this is too small. This is what we're talking about here. <laughs> I said to her that the next time that I go, I actually might make her be the centerpiece of my outfit. <laughs> so big and so over the top. What am I gonna do with this little bow? What's that gonna do? No, got to have her. It's just not gonna be on my head, it's gotta be on my shoulders. <laughs> right, actually, question of the day, what shall I name her? Look at her, look, look, at, look, look at her. Look at her beautiful eyes. She needs a name. Put her name in the comment section below and I will announce the winner um, on my uh, community tab. Yeah, that's what I'll do. When I, when I found the best name, I'll announce it on my community tab. She needs to have a name and I want the Shasha squad to be the ones to do that. She's adorable! Okay, so next, what do we have? What do we have? We have another blue t-shirt. I went a little bit t-shirt mad. And this is from Hoshi Candy. Now, I'm a little bit upset with Hoshi Candy because she's no longer doing these designs but she will be releasing some new designs in the very near future. I mean, I'm happy that she's bringing out new designs, but I just I just love her old ones. Like, they're just so, so gorgeous. Anyway, some of you may have seen um, a, a blue t-shirt that I've worn a few times before um, on my videos, and it has a purple, be a purple bear, a purple bunny uh, called Nemu. <laughs> and I know I have the octopus called Nemu too, but Riley called it Nemu because he liked the purple bunny. Yeah, basically that. Um, and yeah, it's a cute little purple sleeping bunny sleeping on a star. It's absolutely adorable. Um, and yeah, so I wanted to get the starry sheep design and here it is. And this was the very last one that was in my size. And um, it was actually the second to last one at all. So had I come any later, I probably wouldn't have actually been able to get this. So I'm really, really happy that I've got it. And I'm just sad that these designs are going, but you've got to make way for pastures new. So good luck with everything, Miss Hoshi Candy. I'll be linking her in the description box below as well. Um, I also, from Hoshi, got one of her little standees, which are these cute little um, acrylic, like acrylic versions of her designs that sort of go into this sweet little stand just here like that here we go like that is just absolutely gorgeous however i was like um i'm not gonna just have that standing on my desk like i need to wear this so <laughs> i'm gonna make that into a necklace guys i apologize for like the ridiculous amount of glow on my face it is really really hot tonight <sighs> i am sweaty literally have to repowder my face like seriously what is this Okay, so then I went to a shop called Something Kawaii and I got one of these Sumiko Garashi folders. Some of you may have seen that I've um, made a couple of bows before using these plastic folders and I wanted to do the same with this because I just think these characters are ever so adorable. I've got no idea what their names are. I haven't got a clue, but I just thought that they were so, so sweet. So I'm gonna use that, I'm gonna use that to um, to, make a, to make myself a new bow um, because I don't really have anything in these kind of colors. I thought that was super duper cute. So I grabbed that. I also got this beautiful Karina Kuma notepad. How cute is this? So those of you who get yourself some of my crafts can start expecting to have your notes written on things like this. And it even has, 
this one here with all of them all together. How sweet is this? Oh, I love it, I love it, I love it. And I was not going to leave Hyper Japan without something from Little Twin Stars. So I got this card holder, which is so, so cute. And it's obviously for like your credit cards and stuff like that, but I'm gonna use it to put my business cards in so that when I'm giving them out to people, then it comes out of something that's super duper cute. It's adorable, look at the design. You guys already know that I'm like obsessed with little twin stars. So yeah, I love, love, love that design. It's so, so gorgeous. And finally, I went to visit Bunny Boops. Now I actually um, thought that she'd stopped selling because I couldn't find her online for quite some time, but she is back and she had new designs and I was like, oh my God, I'm excited. Because when I first went there, I actually got this necklace. This is her um, her character called Crybaby. And I just thought that it was so, so cute. And so like, I had to just snap this necklace up immediately. And then when I um, when I went to her store, I saw she had this t-shirt. It was like a brand spanking new design. I was like, I need it in my life. So this is a very, very generous sizing. This is a large, it's massive. But look at this. This is so me! I just thought it was so, so adorable. And I cannot, I cannot wait to wear this one. I really, really can't wait. And bless her heart, she even gave me a little badge. She gave me this badge and said for me to give it to Riley because she knows that Riley loves Crybaby. Um, the thing is, he's a little bit too young to have a badge. So I'm just gonna have to wear it. Hee <laughs> hee. So there you have it, my darlings. That is my mini Hyper Japan haul. It's funny, I said that it wasn't a lot, but that's actually, it's actually a fair amount of stuff to be fair it's actually that's actually not too bad <laughs> if you enjoyed this video you already know what to do drop a like if you are loving it and of course if you are brand new to my channel and you are feeling my content girl you know you better just subscribe so that you don't miss the next video if by some chance you happen to miss my uh, 1500 subs giveaway video make sure that you go and check that out immediately so that you don't miss the chance to enter because I wouldn't want that to happen to you. So anyway, with that being said, take care my lovelies and I will see you all soon. Mwah. Bye.